guys, welcome to another month of Project Pan Art Supply Style, a project inspired by the many be beauty gurus here on YouTube, uh, where they go through and use up um, and decide if they like or not um, uh, beauty supplies. In my case, we're doing it with art supplies. And COVID really kind of put a big kind of one-two punch into my efforts, but you know, we're we're working it out anyway. Now, this month, I have to admit, my little pile, which is in front of me, of stuff I've actually used up, um, like in the past couple of months, is small because at some point, I just went through things and said, you know, I don't even like this. I don't even want to use it up. It just needs to go on to a home where it's going to get loved because it's not going to get loved here. And in the month of August, I sold, I'm looking at the Etsy store website right now. So one, two, three, four, five six, seven, eight, eight different priority boxes full of art supplies, eight. So mostly medium, but I think two of the eight were small. So it was, let's see, um, one, let me see, I lost track here. So one, two, three, four, four of the eight were medium, two small and two large. That's a lot of art supplies, um, different kinds of things, ephemera, um, um, finished completed art, um, just all kinds of random things. So much I've forgotten. If you want to see me packing some of the boxes, um, I usually share it in my vlogs every week when I do pack boxes. So you can go back through some of the um, vlogs and see um, what I've packed. Um, I do have two boxes left in the Etsy shop that I packed in August. They're mostly full of like art bags, traveler's journal type covers, um, stuff, stuff from Shannon Green's Etsy shop. Um, I love Shannon Green and I love her stuff. I just ha bought some products that I was gonna like paint and refurbish and, and then resell in my shop with my artwork on them. And I just never did them. And I, I don't think they're gonna get done. So um, their listing is in the Etsy shop. I'll put it down below. And um, the vlog that I show um, packing them is listed in the description. And I am looking at one of the listings and um, I'm being reminded that um, two, the two large boxes, one was full of mark making tools and one was full of paper punches. And I still have a lot of both left because I just had that many. Um, the products I actually used up is I used up um, one of my favorite bit crystals and I have another one downstairs that's just about empty. Um, this is a Otho. Feud, oh, it's a feud ball. I used that up, that's all dead. And a Sharpie white paint pen. Um, I used up a spool of 20 gauge craft wire. I used up a roll of washi tape. How often does that happen for you all? Um, <laughs> I used up some tape runner. And so many stickers. This is just like a small, like I'm making an effort to go through my stickers to use them up in projects to pull them out and use them up in a good way. You don't just use them to use them. Um, whether they're stickers that I've created from the Etsy shop or they're ones I've bought, there's some of both here. Um, and this is, again, this is just like a small bit of stickers and decals and things that I've used up. Um, I do sell, yes, stickers in my Etsy shop. And again, my Etsy shop's listed down below. Um, but I have a large collection of stickers, my own and ones I purchased. I do still purchase stickers because I love them and I like washi tape too. Um, but I'm trying to use what I have before I buy more because let's be honest, I'm going to end up buying more. And um, I usually try to use them in my daily drawing journal. So I've used up a lot. I think I did pretty good this month compared to last month um, where I actually used up some stuff. Yes, I did get rid of a bunch of stuff, but I also did actually use up some things. So, you know, it is what it is. Welcome to the apocalypse. What are you going to do? Um, I, um, I think for the month of October, we are going to try, I found a pencil drawing kit from when I used to teach at Michael's 
kind of forgot I had it. So we are going to, I think every day for October, I'm going to use the pencils and do some drawings in a little sketchbook. And then at the end of the month, I'll decide if I like it enough to keep it or not. I think that's going to be part of Project Pan, Art Supply Style. Um, so we'll see what happens. I might do it as a special project, um, drawing project too, with a bunch of creative friends. So stay tuned for that. But I'm going to continue to go through my project, those things that I've collected and that are just sitting in a corner, sitting in a drawer, kind of forgotten and or not used often. And I, I'm either going to use them or lose them. So watch out for more of these videos where I share that process, but also um, purge boxes. Because if I just decide, you know, I don't even want to, this just needs to go, needs to go. It's going to go in a purge box. So anyway. That's it for this month. How have you done? Whether it's makeup or art supplies or something else, I hope that you're keeping what you love and you're not keeping the clutter that's bogging you down. It, it really is worth it's a, it's a long, hard process, but it's worth the effort. Anyway, that's it for right now. All the relevant links will be in the description below. If you have questions, comments, or concerns, you can leave them here down below, or you can join one of my Facebook groups, uh, groups, one of my Facebook groups, um, you can click on the link tree list of links in the video description. And when you do, you're going to find a list of all the places to find me on the internet, my Instagram, my Facebook groups, my Etsy shop, all that stuff. So check it out and, um, you know, go out and, um, support the free content here on YouTube and over in the Facebook art groups where you can and when you can, not just for me, but for your favorite creatives. They all probably have a way, whether it's an Etsy shop or an affiliate link or something. So check it out and, um, give them support and show them some love. If you can like, share, and subscribe, and don't forget to stay safe, stay creative, stay healthy, and go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. I'll see you later. Bye guys.